Welcome back, sailors, to Admiral Plays, uh, Civilization V, India. So, when we last left, when we last left off, we had captured Hanoi and built ourselves a little bit more of a navy. Um, and we were just gonna sort of focus on that culture, you know? So let's go ahead and pull up our research info, let's go ahead and look at our demographics, see where we are. We're number two in literacy. Um, someone is slightly ahead of us. We may actually want to get a university. And then we have a worker here that, uh, we'll move. We'll get some improvements. We'll actually start with our road, connecting it to the, this road here. Oh, they're already working on the road. So that actually works out. So we'll clear that forest. Yeah, I figured we're just probably going to stay on this continent uh, if we come into conflict with Japan. Which is kind of likely to be. But if we come into conflict with Japan, though they, we do, they do have military access, we can fix that. So we need more trade routes. Otherwise, it's gonna, it's gonna make us look bad. First, let's choose production. Let's go ahead and get a cargo ship. Uh, 13 turns, or we can wait 21 turns and get a university, which <sighs> is pretty good, actually. But we're gonna go with a cargo ship. Let's get unit. Just get that barrage. And alert. Move the war elephants down here. Um, and we have swordsmen. So alert them. And then we have a galley. So that was a trident. Dry Reem is healing. Alright, so, we're here we are as India with our Great Wall of China. We can check our victory progress. We're, mm, we're doing alright. We're doing alright. All players still have their original capitals, which is very good. And we're gonna be doing some good stuff. The only problem I have is this one freaking tile that Japan owns on our continent. They'll probably end up owning like this, but that's fine. Because uh, we're going for a cultural victory. So we will see them in the end. We will we will prevail. <laughs> we will perverse their culture. <laughs> so we're doing really good in population. Makes sense. Really good in crop yield. Makes sense. Actually, we're doing really good in land, too. Um, we are doing pretty poor in approval, though. We're last in approval, but we're not last. We're pretty much one or two in everyone except for soldiers and approval. Uh, so that's good. We're gonna go ahead and just put you to sleep there. Um, so yeah, pretty proud of us. We took, we consolidated our continent, and now we're just going through and fixing everything. Yeah. Alright, so what do we need next? Oh, we can build a farm there. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. <laughs> Just set you up to PA. Move the galley. Galleys, I don't know why I don't have much. So now we actually have three coastal cities, which is pretty good. Um, it's kind of realistic, actually, because India's major city, Delhi, is inland. But Mumbai is the coastal city, I think. Yeah, Mumbai is a coastal city. And then Bombay and all that is coastal city. Obviously, these aren't Indian cities. But who cares? <laughs> so, yeah, Japan just kind of walking around with some pikemen. Hey, Japan. Let's see you there. We're about to get astronomy, which will take us into the Renaissance. Joyfully to All right, the enemy is near. Trade route plundered. 
freaking. Oh man. I'm gonna have to show them who's boss, these barbarians. First of all. Second of all, move you on top of the workers. Construct the road. Alright, what technology are we gonna go for now? Um hold up. I have to I have a soda here, I'm gonna take a drink real quick. Ah, sorry about that. Okay. Alright, so if we get the chivalry, that'll actually give us Moogle Fort, which Yeah, we'll do chivalry. So hopefully Japan and the Aztecs do not go to war with us. As long as we keep a strong standing army, that should stave off any invasions. Um, it is kind of concerning that they just have pikemen running through my town. Um, ah, yeah, you're dead. Ah, sucker. And... Ha, <laughs> killed him. Alright. There are no barbarian camps on our island, because our island is pretty much consolidated, like I said. So we just got astronomy, which allows embarked movements to cross oceans. Um, and we can actually go ahead and upgrade a trireme to a caravel, and it can explore for us. So we'll take this trireme here, no, not that galley, but this trireme, upgrade it to a caravel, and yeah, that should do it. Now what do we want? The Hagia Sophia will give us three faith, yeah, we actually do need a religion. And, oh wait, we can't find any religions. Darn. That sucks. Um, well, I guess we'll just we'll go ahead and see uh, victory progress. We're not doing too well in the culture wars, you know. <laughs> not doing too well. Not doing too well at all. <laughs> so that is a bit unfortunate. We have a very, very lush farmland here in the center of our empire. Kind of realistic. India is a very agrarian society. So... So that would make sense to have a lush farmland. We have a pikeman. There. And we have our second galley. Excellent. You explore. Explore the world. Do a writer's guild, artist guild, anchor lot. Um, let's do a university so we can get that science up. We might go for a science victory too. Um, if culture doesn't work out, I can try to grab a science victory. So. Alright, let's adopt that policy, you know? Aesthetics. So right now that's not going to give us much because we're pretty unhappy. But, it should help us a little bit once we get our happiness recovered. Which should be relatively soon because this city is... It's full production potential, you know? And I want it to. I want you to produce produce as much as you can. Hanoi, do you understand? So we're gonna actually switch you to production for this. So that way we can get it done pretty quickly. Get that courthouse done. Ah, uh, sorry about that again. Oh no! Not that player has lost. Wow, that really sucks. It really sucks. 
Um, so someone's going for that domination victory. Uh, so that is a bit concerning. Maybe, just a little bit. Maybe, just a little bit. Alright, what are we going to work on now? New navigation, that would give us really good ships. This one's a seaport, but... Banking, this is one mercantile. We can go to gunpowder. Let's get... Let's get steel. Um, that way we can get those long swordsmen. And, oh, we got a lot of iron. I just realized that. <laughs> Um, yeah, and it, it'll work out. So, level 21 in Delhi, which is crazy. Uh, Kyoto is 10. Tenochtitlan. Tenochtitlan. I'm pretty sure that's how you say that. Is 11. Jakarta is 10. And meanwhile, Delhi is just over here, 21. <laughs> it's just crazy. So there's our caravel, and our steps are exploring as well. Zanzibar cancels quest! Ooh. Hey! We demand. Yeah, stop spying on us. <laughs> Jerks. Why am I moving to the town of Chitwan? I should probably protect Delhi. Because I am! Not number one in research, but I am number two, and I'm very close to being number one. So I don't want them to steal my technology anymore. So yeah, we're gonna keep them. Oh, crap! Let me this but the scouts have cannons, like. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, let's see what else can we do. Nothing. Okay, next turn. Two more turns and we'll get the cargo ship. We're not to get anchor what? Oh, Hagia Sophia. Which is a church, then a mosque, and now it's a museum. There it is. Three great prophet appears. Ah, oh, I can't do shit with three prophet. This should be no more. Oh, might as well just just my end of that. <laughs> okay. Writer's Guild. Anchor lot we can do. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> let's do Anchor lot. Because that seems like something that is pretty useful, actually. One more turn and we get that that sweet, sweet cargo ship. <laughs> There's Antanarivo, Zanzibar. We have zero trade routes, so... Yeah. Who do we trade with? Let's trade with Kyoto. Choose production... Hmm. Let's do university. Uh, excuse me, sorry. Let's do a m uh, market. We'll do banking. Actually, it's not banking. Physics. And that should be it for now. Next turn. We're in 1320, and we're already in the Renaissance, so we're doing pretty good, technology-wise. Second in literacy, most in land, most in crop yield, most in population, but we're lowest in approval still. Why do we still have minus four? What is wrong? Okay, ten from occupied cities, so... That'll be fixed here pretty soon. Where are some empty tiles? There's one up there with a the trading post. Uh, 
I think this is a pretty interesting spawn. Like, Japan's just on this weird peninsula. And they're expanding into our land. We may have to go to war with Japan. But I don't want to because I want to get that culture, you know. I don't need to go to you build a meeting post. That's the only thing that you can build on a tundra, so might as well. Now we can do the, the Colosseum. Once you're done with the university, we'll go build a cargo ship out of there. And that should fix all of our problems. Hormus promoted. Good job, Hormus. We found Sidon. Woo! Choose production. We can build a cargo ship. Six turns. Because we need that the, those trading routes, you know? We lost our overs. Datan munang kito, umalahaken, at morning ulo. I forgive you. I forgive Indonesia because I don't want to be. I want to be peaceful, you know, like India. Live by Buddhist ways. Uh, okay, so open borders with Japan. Japan is now guarded with us. Oh, Suchika. I don't know why they suddenly don't like us. Uh, let's see what our advisor says. Indonesia, uh, yeah, Japanese is slightly stronger, but I think we could beat them in a war, because we'll probably be fighting defensively, so if they do decide, and plus we're about to get gunpowder, and we're probably um, pretty technologically advanced. We are. We are the most technologically advanced. And we're no longer lowest in approval. Yay! <laughs> Alright, so... But we still have a ton of unhappiness. So much unhappiness. Alright. Oh, we found the Behringer Crater. That's an Arizona, I believe. I think. Is it in Arizona? It might be. Uh, what two, two specialists there? They're in the market. There you go. We'll turn off manual specialist control. Except for up here in Hanoi. I want that market. Actually, no. Okay. The specialists take away six things, so. Take away citizenry from that. From, uh. Like that can work the land. It takes away citizens and they work in buildings instead. So they're like uh, specialization of labor. So we're doing pretty good so far. We get 17 culture a turn. Uh, someone built the Forbidden Palace. Darn. Let's see how our exploration is going. Pretty good so far, actually. We'll probably end up discovering some new... some new tribes, some new civs along the way. The unit needs orders. Okay, you built a line there. So build another one, I guess. Montezuma has... Ah, Notre Dame. Yeah, we'll take that. But Notre Dame, that's so good. That's such a good one, too. Uh, I don't know what to do with it. Frowny face. Where is Notre Dame? Is it in the Renaissance era? I swore it was in... The classical era. I don't know if Forbidden Palace is... It's in the mid industrial no, it's definitely not in the industrial area. Where is Notre Dame? Notre Dame. Notre Dame. Oh, it's physics. I just finished physics, so. Uh, construction. Yeah, we got a few wonders. Uh, 
Chikuini Spices Lenin for Coco, Kimichi. yeah, sure. <laughs> that works. Hormus promoted again. Good job, Hormus. You're doing pretty good. Established trade route. What is our next great person? Where can you find five turns in Citizen's Corn? Six turns of Water Grove. Where is what is our next great person? Oh, it'll probably end up being a great scientist. We might go for a science victory then. Okay, you. Do you have a university? You do have a university. Okay, let's give you a Coliseum then. Uh, what are we gonna do with you guys? We'll move you down. Got a little bit of desert in the middle of our. In the middle of our, I guess you could call it a continent. I don't wanna harbor any hostility, so I forgive you. I turn the other cheek, you know. <laughs> Let us see how we're doing as far as culture goes. Victory progress. We the United Nations has not yet begun. You're zero percent influential over the Aztecs. Okay, we're zero percent influential over everybody. So our unit needs orders, and we're gonna move you down to here into Tire. Tire, I guess Tire, because that's how they say it. They spell it. it oh, excuse me. That's how they spell it in the UK, right? Tire. I don't know what's going on with these roads here. Um, so yeah. Well, this is all we have time for this time, guys. Uh, I have been Admiral Atlas. Oh, Anchor what? See, there you go. I have been Admiral Atlas. Uh, thank you for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See you next time.